New York Jets are at odds of 50 to 1 to win the Super Bowl, and their season win total is at 7.5. Last season saw the Jets go 4 and 12 straight up and 6 9 and 1 against the spread, with the team going over the total in 7 games and under in 9. The New York Jets have a new head coach and a lot of new players as they look to contend in the AFC East for 2015. There are a lot of things to like about the Jets, from their new head coach Todd Bowles and the return of quarterback Daryl Revis to the additions of wide receiver Brandon Marshall and running back Zach Stacy. But the Jets have one glaring hole, and that is at quarterback. It's hard to get too excited about a team that is starting Geno Smith. The oddsmakers think that the Jets have a chance to contend this season, as they have set the win total for the New York Jets at 7.5 over. The Jets made some good moves in the offseason, but for some reason they did not address their major problem at quarterback. They're sticking with Geno Smith as their starter. If Smith struggles, which seems likely, then they will turn to Ryan Fitzpatrick. Neither player inspires a lot of confidence, which is why it is hard to take the Jets seriously as AFC East contenders. The Jets did go out and get Brandon Marshall from the Chicago Bears, but they have no one to get him the ball. The team took Devin Smith in the draft to replace the often injured Percy Harvin. The Jets also added Zach Stacy and Steven Ridley to give Chris Ivory some competition at running back. The offensive line could be better with the addition of James Carpenter, who is in Seattle. The Jets made a number of moves in the offseason to upgrade the defense, as they got Darrell Revis, Antonio Cromartie, Buster Scrine, and Marcus Gilchrist. They also took Leonard Williams, Lorenzo Malden, and Deion Simon in the draft. There is a lot to like about the Jets on defense for 2015. Their new head coach Todd Bowles is a defensive guy, so he will have a dynamic defense installed in New York. He has the secondary to make it work, and he has a front three of Muhammad Wilkerson, Damon Harrison, and Sheldon Richardson to put pressure on the opposing quarterbacks. Richardson will have to sit out the first four games due to suspension, so Williams should start right away as a rookie. The Jets have all the pieces in place to be contenders in 2015 except at quarterback. It is hard to see the Jets finishing with a winning record unless they can resolve their quarterback issue. For our picks and predictions, we'll look for the New York Jets to go 7-9 and nine in 2015. Join us at BetDSI.com for the best New York Jets betting options, including futures, props, and live in-progress betting during the games.